So this is a tutorial for some things fishy. So the first two things we learned from the briefing is that one, the username is fishy Tony, and two, it's probably a, an account on Twitter. So I'm just gonna Google fishy Tony, which is the first thing you should always do in an OSINT challenge. Just Google it and see what comes up. All right, so the first thing that comes up is a bunch of um, accounts. The first one, which matches the username perfectly, looks like a good match. So we're going to go there. And the bio itself looks pretty suspicious. So we'll go with that. And I'm just going to start from the beginning. Um, so the first post is about the profile picture, but it doesn't look um, very suspicious. Not really any clues. It gives you a website, but the website doesn't really lead you anywhere. So we come to the second post, and you see a picture of a Caesar salad. So if you look here under, there's a comment that also says, by the way, I love the fact that Twitter added the ability to edit the alt text of images. Makes it much more accessible for others. So that's a big hint that there might be something hiding in the alt text. So the way you would um, get the alt text is using inspect. So you can get that using F12 or you can right click and click inspect or you can do control shift I. So I'm just going to right click and click inspect. And then when, once you get an inspect, you have to select the image. So you can select um, if the image wasn't so selected already, which it is right here. You would click this icon and then you would click on the image. So that just highlights the image images HTML code right here. So once we get here, we see that there is something in the alt text and it says encoded flag is this and um, you found it, but it's you're not completely done yet. So another hint, the next part of this challenge is a picture. So there's something called a Caesar cipher, which is why um, we put this salad picture here, Caesar salad. So the best tool for this is going to be CyberChef. So I'm going to double click to copy paste. That's not cooperating. So I'm going to click edit attribute. And I'm going to, okay, whatever. I'm just going to copy the whole thing. So I'm just going to copy the whole element. Then I'm going to um, paste it into CyberChef here. I'm just going to remove this part. All right, so now in CyberChef, it's not going to be called Caesar Cipher. It's actually going to be called ROT. And the reason is, is because um, Cy um, Caesar Cipher is just rotating the alphabet. So that's why it's called ROT, rotate. So it's going to rotate the alphabet 13 times. And when we do that and we decode it, we get hiding in the salad, which is the flag. And yeah, so that's how you solve that challenge. And I'm just going to show you one more thing. In case you do not have inspect, you might need to turn that on, which is why we also added um, another tweet right here to kind of clue into that. You have to turn on the web inspector. All right, so that's it for this challenge. Just ping us on Discord if you need anything else.